My con contract uh, has been dealing with a barbarian that lives in the mountain, not too far from Frost Craig Spire, actually. Oh, in fact, that him right there. Hello, neighbor. It's a shame we never met until now. Huh? Whoa! 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 I fought mud crabs more fierce than that. Come on, do you really think you have a chance against me? Look at my weapon and arm compared to yours. Okay. Oh, and I should probably take care of his dog as well. Sorry, I had to do that, doggy. So, it's in here. Ten drop all the number seven. And a reward. Pick up. I complete my next contract. I must go to the city of Reville and lie in wait near the ancient statue known as the Lucky Old Lady. I would have known as Unglum visit the statue every night between around 5pm and 1am to make a wish, as is the local custom. I see Unglum, I must kill him. I should be warned, however, that Unglum has been alerted to danger, and if he senses an assassin, will probably attack on sight. It's also bribe the guards to look that way if there's a fight. Perhaps a stealth. Road will be best. Well, you bribe the guards to look the other way, so that means I won't get caught. If I get caught, then I won't be in trouble, at least. What the? Eh? Oh, come on! I was barely near you. Well, fine. I'll play that. I'll race forward, then. Perhaps. Whoa! Whoa! Hmm? Hmm? What are you aiming at? Okay. Whoa! Okay, so... He is quite tough. But, not tough enough. Okay, your blood turns to ice as a familiar shadow draws near. Okay, so... Oh, no! I'm too late. I thought I could get here in time. Thought I could stop you! What? By Sithis, what have you done? What madness has claimed you? You have betrayed me. You have betrayed the Dark Brotherhood. Why? What do you mean? I am here to end your miserable life. To... But... Uh, I can see the confusion in your eyes. You... Oh. You have no idea what I'm talking about. Do you? Yeah. What are you talking about? Your first dead drop contract. You carried that out. Killed Celadon. After that, you eliminated the Draconis family, as ordered then. Mm -hmm. Betrayal. What? Your dead drops went unvisited. Your targets ignored. Instead, you have been systematically killing off all of the members of the Black Hand. Jagasta, Shali, Zuvalovani, Havelstein, Horblood, Speakers and Silencers all, and Ungolum, the Listener himself. What? The surviving members of the Black Hand know you're innocent. They know you're only following orders. They believe I am the traitor. Wait, wait a moment. Wait, you, you, you. wait, 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 wait. Wait a moment. You... First, you said you were coming to kill me because of... Because of... Hang on. Let's backtrack here. First you came here to kill me because you thought I... They, they knew I was only following orders, so, so... So what... Why would you think I was deliberately betraying... Oh. What? Anyway, um... 
Mikis, you have a plan? Somehow switched your orders and has been sending you to the wrong dead drops. You and I have been deceived. We mm -hmm. must find out who is behind this betrayal. We haven't much time. I'm hunted day and night by the Black Hand. They want me dead. Here is what you must do. Go now to your next dead drop. Lie in wait and confront whomever drops off the false contract. Uncover the true traitor's hey. identity and then come see me. I'll be in hiding. For Farrakh, it is no longer secure. It's under watch by the Black Hand. I'll wait for you at Apple Watch. The farm Ooh. where you killed the old Dracoon ah. woman. It should be empty and safe. Now go. And may Scythus help us all. So I just killed the, the leader of the Dark Brotherhood in Sildu. Mm-hmm. Oh! Excuse me. No, no, please don't hurt me. He paid me to do it. I'm... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do anything wrong. It, it was the robed man. He... He paid me to put those things in the barrel. I don't Both know his man? name, and his face was in shadow. He called to me yesterday as I walked by the lighthouse. I think he lives there. The lighthouse? Or he did, okay. anyway. He told me he was leaving Anvil. I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Alright. Tell me it's about just the outside lighthouse. the city walls. I think the robed man has lived there for quite some time. In, in the cellar. I don't know okay. what goes on down there. But there's a horrible smell coming from underneath that door. It's like something died inside. Listen, that's Probably all I did. know, really. Maybe Ulfgar Fogai can tell you more. He's the lighthouse keeper and probably rented out the cellar. Talk, okay. talk to Ulfgar. He's sure to have the key to the cellar. You know, if, if you want to get down there. Now, please, just let me go. Anyway, just she myself, I'll read what the final fake dropped at orders are. All of them is dead, sir. And so you've served me be far better than I could have imagined. Is there no challenge you can't meet? No opponent you can't best? We shall see. Your next target is a high elf four named Akron. It's been difficult to locate, but you might try ask around Grey Mare and Crow oh, or Bridgen at Shane Hall. I can't be talked, and it's a skill fire and will not be eliminated easily. Pick up under our beds in Laven Ga Coast Guard Station. Hmm. Mm hmm. Ooh! I hear another nun. Anyway, Mr. Lighthouse Keeper, you here? Three hours later. Oh, hello. Well, now, what might you want? Oh, do you now? And just why should I give you that? Hmm. Oh, I'll slice your throat. Oh, well, in that case, um. Here you go. See, that wasn't so hard, was it? Okay then. Ugh. Why? Why is that just a dead dog? Yeah. What? In dead people, Alex. 
I think that. <laughs> what? I'm behind that. Dog. It's all right, mother. It's almost over. I'm close. So very close. How long have I traveled? How long have we waited? Too long, I know. But it's almost over, I promise. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Mommy, mommy, as you lie, the, the dark man comes and makes you die, my daddy. His hands are red with guilt because he killed the life we built. I hate it. All this lie. All this pretending. Sifis and the five turns be damned. How long do I have to live by their rules? How long before I get my chance? I saw Lucian the chance yesterday. He was in the sanctuary talking with Ochiva. He was right there. So close I could have severed his spine in less than a heartbeat. Oh, mama, never before have I had to exercise such self-control. What certainly I like is that if it was the Dark Prophet's discipline, allow me to restrain myself. I've been part of the family for so long, it's a part of me, whether I like it or not. And in all that time I fooled them, they see me as a fellow member of, of brother, a trusted family member. Someday I will learn the truth about the night mother, and when I do, I will use that trust to get close to her, close enough that I may rend the head from her body, just as Lucian Chance did to you so long ago. So, so this was revenge. Damn it, mother! Why did it have to be this way? Maria was so beautiful. She was perfect in so many ways. Why couldn't she howl the truth? Why couldn't she realize her family didn't really love her? She was a murderer like the rest of us, paid to kill in the name of Sifis. I really thought we could be together, make a real family, with real love. But she told me she could never accept your place in my life. So she's gone now. Oh, so that's who that one was. She didn't deserve to live after the horrible things she said about you. I never should have told her. I know, I'm sorry. It'll never happen again, and the others will never find her. Don't worry. There's nothing left of her to find. Oh. Lex. Oh, I did, Mama. I killed them. I killed them all. And I cursed them to wander their ship in undead for all eternity. They came to talk to the old man in the lighthouse. When they saw me, they could have kept walking. But no, they laughed. They laughed me, Mama. They called me names. They said I was strange, that I was a... Human rat, lying here in the cell of the lighthouse. They did not know who they were dealing with. I snuck on board later that night. I slit their throats. Every last one of them. So the... The serpent wakes its... The ghost ship of Ando, they call it now. Ha 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 ha! Hmm. Interesting. Some wonderful news, mother. I fast me at last. Lucian Lachance paid a visit to the sanctuary today. Talk with me. He told me the Black Hand need my services. One of the speakers is looking for places assistant who was killed fulfilling a contract. So Lucian of Chance suggests me. I met with the speaker and served as his new silencer. Ha! The Chance might as well have given me a contract to kill a night mother herself. I am now one step closer to realizing our dream. I'll learn night mother's identity and tear the heart from her chest. Oh yes, I have something special planned for the Chance himself. Mummy, I'm so afraid. I miss you, Mummy. I just want you to kiss me again. I was afraid, and guess who came? The hooded man in Sif's name who left. But then he came once more to pass through the window and walk. I am feared. My mouth gagged. We played with Cleave on the night before. I was watching the bed. He falling off your head, and when you face the eye on the floor, Loving eyes did meet once more. I pledged to you the day the dog would daily pay, and just they took me, I'd find kill their mother. But there's someone I need to start, and that's with powers being hard. And when that's done, I'll dance. Green, blue, red, blah, 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 blah. 
I've been careless, too careless. The boys, the burnings, killing that fool Anchard was the worst mistake I made so far. I was seen, I was cloaked in hood, escaped into shadows, so no one learned my true identity. But now the black hair is suspicious. They suspect treachery. Suspect a traitor. I must be more coarse than ever. When in the snow I, I like to lie and fold my arms and wait to die. I've been switching them, switching the dead drops. It was so easy. I tracked the chance from his lair and fought for it. To the first dread dead drop location. After the chance placed orders, when I was sure he was gone, I switched him. It was so easy. Our chances also aren't to work for us, mother. Oh, the fun we'll have! Well, the Black Hand told me they haven't seen such an ambitious family member since I first joined Dark Brotherhood. I'll use that very ambition to my own advantage. The fool never questioned the dead drops. As I write this, en route to the first target are the very members of the Black Hand. And so it begins. A chance science will kill one high ranking brother member, then another, then another, and so on, until the entire family implodes. Eventually, as is custom, I will consult the Night Mother and seek her guidance. When that day comes, I'll be there, ready to plunge a blade into that dark horse's fetish heart. Ah, well, this is all the evidence I need. Okay! Lucian! Oh. Silencer, at last you've arrived. Fear not, for the crisis that has threatened the Dark Brotherhood has finally come to an end. I am Arquin, speaker for the Black Hand. As you can see, we have dealt with the betrayer, Lucian Lachance. No longer will you serve as his puppet. It seems Lachance wanted revenge against the Dark Brotherhood for some reason, and used you to do his dirty work. Wait, no, 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 no. But now we can begin anew. I bestow upon you the title of speaker. You will take Lucien Lachance's place on the Black Hand. Welcome. As you know, huh? the Black Hand is now in a state of disarray. Lachance ordered you to kill us off. We five, including you, are now all that remain. Even worse, you killed the listener. The Black Hand without a listener is like a hand with no thumb. Even the listener's successor is dead. Oh? So, we have no choice but to invoke an ancient ritual. We must wake the Night Mother from her slumber and seek her guidance. Between the hours of midnight and 3 a.m., ask me about the Night Mother, and we will away to Our Lady's home. Only then will the ritual begin. But wait, I... Wait, you're, you're wrong. I have... It's journal. May the night mother uh, hold you in her cold embrace. Don't you think you're a bit rash? Yeah, maybe the way you deal with problems isn't the May best. May you forever serve the night mother. Lucian the chance had been murdered, stripped, and mutilated by the black hand. Sadly, they fought heals the traitor and punished him accordingly. Yikes. You are like an unholy vision, so beautiful. Hello, fellow speaker. Welcome to the Black Hand. So nice to see you're in one piece. You should take some time to admire his corpse. It really is a thing of beauty. The punctures and slashes are almost poetic. That's one way of putting it. You always walk in the shadow of death. Greetings, fellow speaker. Our troubles are almost at an end, sister. Soon we will visit the Night Mother, and she will surely guide us. Uh. The four of us attacking him in unison was as graceful and beautiful as a ballet. The flashing of steel, the spraying of blood. Then why can't I show any of these guys the journal? Sithis be with you. Greetings, speaker. Most of my time is now spent on administrative duties. I have not had blood on my hands in far too long. Killing Lachance was pure ecstasy. Dear Speaker, when darkness shrouds the Empire, we can travel to the resting place of the Night Mother and begin the ritual of awakening. 
Okay, is now the time or... You must understand our need for darkness and secrecy. Speak to me only between the hours of midnight and 3 a.m. and we will be off. Okay. 12 o'clock midnight. The Night Mother must be awakened so that we may seek her guidance. Are you ready to travel now to her resting place? Yes. Very go. good. And so it begins, the Black Hand's journey into a darkness few can imagine. Let us be off. The Night Mother awaits. <laughs> Behold the Night Mother. The locals oh. call this statue the Lucky Old Lady. They have no idea how lucky they really are. For this stone effigy masks the entrance into the Dark Brotherhood's most revered unholy site. The Crypt of the Night Mother herself. Uh -huh. In a moment, we will begin. I will recite an incantation, and we can proceed down into the crypt and seek an audience with the Night Mother. I know this is all very overwhelming, dear child. Just follow along and you'll be fine. Now, let's go see what the future holds, shall we? Sure. Huh? Unholy matron, we of the Black Hand beseech you. Reveal yourself now, most magnificent Night Mother, so that we may seek your guidance. Oh, like the way it twists and the babies fell apart. All right. Well, oh, the tray will reveal themselves. Okay. So what you're the, you're the night mother. Who has disturbed my ancient slumber? Dearest night mother, most unholy maiden, please we beg your mercy in this our time of need. The black hand seeks your guidance. Ah, yes, I have been expecting you. The listener now kneels by Sithis, as does his successor. There is a traitor amongst you. The traitor is dead, dear mother. We have come now to ask your blessing. Anoint one of us your listener so we can restore the black hand. Foolish little girl. Lucian Lachance served Sithis till his dying breath. The black hand Oops. remains tainted by betrayal. Restoration is impossible. Enough. Oops. Enough of this. <laughs> You will all suffer for the pain you have caused me. I will destroy your night mother, and the Dark Brotherhood will fall. Jesus, spirit, you dumbass! <laughs> he doesn't seem to be doing any harm to her at all. Hello. At last we meet. I have been following your strange journey through the Dark Brotherhood, young one. Your killing of the old man Banyan, the execution of Adamus Villeneuve, the way you stalked and murdered each member of the Draconis family. Your purification of the Jaden Hall Sanctuary. Morning. I savage revenge. I just even managed to single handedly eliminate half of the facing the dark brotherhood questline. <laughs> I reveled so in this slaughter. You did, my child, so you did. <laughs> Obeyed your orders and showed no mercy or remorse. How could I ask for a better servant? <laughs> if only my other children had served me so well. You see, I have known of Matthew Bellamont's intentions since he was just a boy. I knew of his thirst for vengeance. I could have informed my listener, but I refused. Refused to reward such incompetence. I'm gone. It's weak. Uh, 
Indeed, I allowed Matthew Bellamont to proceed on his destructive course, just as I allowed you to intercept him. Again! Again, maybe you need to run... Maybe the way the Dark Brothers run needs some improvement, but why are the Night Don't Brothers? You see? Our dread father foresaw your defeat of the traitor here in this very crypt. You have been chosen. You are to be my new listener. You possess strength and cunning and a heart as black as midnight. You were marked by Sithis the moment you emerged from your mother's womb. I didn't. I didn't merge my mother's womb. I'm an Argonian. I came from an egg. Well, um, yeah, I guess the egg came from a womb. Huh? What now? Go, take a few moments to collect yourself. Meditate upon all that has transpired. Help yourself to any treasures this crypt may offer. When you are ready, speak with me again. And I will deliver you safely to the only place you can truly call home, the Jaden Hall Sanctuary. There is much work to be done, and when you are back in the sanctuary, speak with Arquen. She will serve as your humble servant and guide. Hey, so I'm listener of the Dark Brotherhood now. The night, the night mother gave me permission to under her tumor. Wait, so, so is that? Is that? Is that your corpse or? Okay, well, that's not. That's not a crib. That's a chest. Um. Where uh, are those? Are those the skeletons of babies? If he wanted to destroy the mother, he should have destroyed that corpse. I assume that's. Uh, anyway. You've returned. I trust you've weighed the importance of your new position. Mm -hmm. For you will soon <coughs> hear words that will change lives. Alter destinies. Uh huh. And I hope you've taken everything you desire from my crypt. Once you leave, you will be unable to return. Now, are you ready to begin your new life? Yes. I'm ready. Send me to the sanctuary. Very good. Now begins your true journey. We will soon become very intimate. You and I. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh. Before I send you away, however, I would like to present you with a rather special reward. Mm hmm? I see you still possess the Blade of Woe, the weapon given you by Lucy Machance when you first met. Mm -hmm. Allow me now to unlock its true power. Yes, you will now find the Blade of Woe a bit more potent than it was. Now go. Leave this crypt and serve our dread father till your dying breath. Well, removed. Blade of Woe added. Honored listener, I offer myself as your humble servant and guide. Please allow me to mentor you in your new role. Here's okay. what I believe we should do next. I will stay here and attempt to re-establish this sanctuary. I will begin recruiting new members. Mm -hmm. You must fulfill your new duties. The statue in Breville serves as a conduit between the Night Mother and the listener. Once Me? a week, you must visit the statue. Talk to it. You will be presented with a list of names and locations. 
These are people who have prayed to the Night Mother. They request a visit from a speaker to arrange someone's assassination. Mm -hmm. All you need to do is visit the statue once a week, get the list of names and locations, and pass it on to me here in the sanctuary. All right. Do this, and I will give you your share of the sanctuary's weekly earnings. There is so much work to be done. So much work. Right, well, you better get to it.